This is problem number 26 from the uh, June 2015 Algebra Regents exam. Alex is selling tickets to a school play. An adult ticket costs $6.50 and a student ticket costs $4. Alex sells X amount of adult tickets and 12 student tickets. What we need to do is write a function to represent how much money Alex collected from selling these tickets. So in the end, we know that the function, oops, we know that the function is going to be a combination of the, the amount of money he earned from adult tickets, so the adult money, plus the amount of money he's going to collect from the student tickets. So that's kind of our goal here. Now, the amount of money that he's going to get from the adult tickets is that it'll be the price, which is $6.50. And we're going to multiply that by the amount of adult tickets sold. And that is represented by our variable x. And then we're going to add the amount of money uh, made from the student tickets. We know that each student ticket costs $4. And we're going to multiply that by the number of student tickets sold. And we actually know that he sold 12 tickets. So we're going to do that times 12. Okay. And so in the end, our function is going to be 650x plus 48, because that's what 4 times 8 is, or sorry, 4 times 12 is. And if we're writing this with proper math grammar, it's probably better not to include that 0 there. So it's really just 6.5x plus 48. So again, this six, the 6.5x 6 represents the amount of money earned from adult tickets, and the 48 is the amount of money he earned from selling the student tickets. So I hope that makes sense. And that's all for this video. Thanks for visiting JD's Regents Preparation.